A high court sitting in the Federal Capital Territory has dismissed all forgery allegations leveled against the national chairman of the All Progressive Grand Alliance, APGA, Chief Edozie Njoku, by the Nigeria police. The judgment was delivered by Justice Mohamed Madagu, Madugu on Tuesday. The judge dismissed all the 14 count charges preferred against the APGA chairman by the police. Recall that the police had on November 22, 2022, charged Chief Njoku and the youth leader of ABGA, Chuko Emeka Nwoga, to court over a protect, or purported allegation of conspiring with others at large to alter a judgment of the Supreme Court delivered by Justice Mary Peter Odili, retired. The court held that due to lack of sufficient and credible evidence, the prosecution has failed woefully to prove its case against the defendants. Relief, there's more than relief. It's just incredible. Um, there's nothing as great as truth. You know, a court where I was taken for, you all heard it, I was taken for impersonation, um, conspiracy, forgery, all of them, and that I wasn't national chairman of Africa. I was cleared on conspiracy, cleared on, uh, on, um, uh, on um, forgery, cleared on everything, and number 10 came on to say that I was the national chairman of the party. That any letter I wrote, I should be writing it as the national chairman of the party. And it, it shows that um, there is a big war in this country. The war of justice, the war of truth, and the war of peace. That if I was not a resilient person, maybe because I was not born in this country, we do things differently. A normal person would not have stayed this distance. But I just don't believe that I could be national chairman of the party. And some people who think that they are powerful will say I'm not going to be. It's only God that can say I will not be national chairman. And we've gone to Supreme Court, Supreme Court has said I am. We've gone to um, Supreme Court, they said I am. So today, that criminal charge that they keep, I neck have been shouting that they are not giving me anything because I'm in a criminal charge. Today, the criminal charge has been cleared. Today, another judgment has come out that I'm the national chairman of the party. So why would INEC not recognize me? That's the, that's the question that you guys should not be asking INEC directly. You said he forged the Supreme Court judgment. That's why we're not giving. Now he's been cleared. And that same court has declared him as national chairman again. So what's the problem? Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel. And don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.